When people ask me, how does a robotic system work? There are three main parts of a robotic system and I'd like to explain it to you. The first and the most important part is this one. This is the patient side robot. Now the patient robot per se consists of four arms as you can see like the tentacles of an octopus and these help us to perform the particular kind of surgery. Now they enter into the patient's chest through small pinholes that we call ports. This is where all the instruments go inside to different parts and corners of the chest and enable the surgeon to perform the surgery. They also carry a camera that enables him to see inside the chest. The second part is this. This is the surgeon console. Now what does the surgeon console do? The surgeon console is like a VR room box. It's got a three-dimensional vision for the surgeon to look inside and see whatever is going to happen at the patient's side. In addition, there are small gadgets around where the surgeon can put his fingers inside and control the robots just like a normal hand movement. What's interesting to note is that though the surgeon may just have two hands, he can simultaneously control all the four arms of the robot. That kind of makes him much more better and efficient. The third part of the robotic system is the patient cart. Now the patient cart consists of a vision tower, energy sources, alarm devices and safety mechanisms that are built in. It helps coordinate and synchronize between the robot per se and the robotic surgeon console. This ensures patient safety, accuracy and enables the entire team in the operating room to know what's going on. 